A good morning. I'm here in front of the Benja Siri Park and you see the sign of the APEC 2022. Well, the APEC 2022 is a summit that's held in Thailand this year. There are 21 of the world leaders of the Pacific region and uh, they are having a big conference now in the new Queen Circuit National Convention Center. And that's why officially today and tomorrow we have a public holiday. And this always means that it's a perfect timing for me to go and bike around and give you an update about the M-Sphere. As you can see, it's getting along quite nicely. Yeah, so the government decided to create three public holidays during the summit. And this is to ease the traffic. It's seven o'clock in the morning. And uh, yeah, you can see that it's a lot less traffic. And a little bit later, I will show you where they closed down the Rachada Pisek Road. It's going to be interesting to see how this project is going to evolve here. So there's going to be the M Life, which is a big music hall. Then there's going to be an IKEA in here which would be the third IKEA in Bangkok. Let's see how that is gonna go uh, with the traffic in the future. So here on the corner, you have the new Kush House, which is one of the larger, or if not the largest cannabis dispensary in town and this is something that i will give you a bit more information about in the near future So the Rachada Pisek road is uh, completely shut down. So this would be the entrance towards the apex. The Queen Circuit National Convention Center is right around the corner here. And uh, the only way you can get in here is when you're registered for the APEC. Okay, cool. <laughs>
you know this is how i started the global travel mate during the pandemic when a lot of the streets were closed down so of course this is not the same let's see if the park is open So here on the main Sukhumvit road, every few hundred meters there is a, a guard post manned by police. Yeah, so I was wondering if the entrance to the park is open and it seems to be no problem or what? Well. Yeah, as I already suspected, so during the summit, this park is closed until the 20th. So it says here temporarily closed from 14 until 20 of November. So due to the Asia Pacific Economic Cooperation, the APEC 2022, it's temporarily closed from 14 until 20 of November. Well, the green mile is still open. So I'm gonna pursue my exercise here. It's actually interesting. They made uh, the parking space here into a helicopter platform and there were like uh, eight, uh, six helicopters yeah of course this park is perfect for a summit like that and uh, I guess this is where the world leaders are gonna be flown, flown in 
So uh, there are 21 members of APEC, which are all the countries that are, let's say, around the Pacific Ocean. So the prime ministers of most countries are going to be here. The Mexican president is not going to be here. Joe Biden is not going to be here. But the vice president, the president of Canada is going to be here, of Japan. So Trudeau will be here. Uh, Emmanuel Macron from France is an honorable guest. It's a proper important summit. And it's important enough to give the people of Bangkok, Nontaburi and Samut Prakan three days of holiday. So if you're in Bangkok this week and you wanted to enjoy the Benja Kitty Park, unfortunately it's closed. It will be closed until the 20th. So even this part of the Green Mile has been closed off. So if you're in Bangkok and you're planning to visit the Benja Kitty Park, unfortunately that's not going to work until the 20th at least. For me it's okay, I mean uh, I like public holidays because there's less traffic on the street so I'm going to bike around. I hope you enjoyed this update regarding the information about the APEC 2022. If you enjoyed it, feel free to subscribe, drop me a line and see you guys in my next uh, video. Uh,